already not expecting the shaders to take so long. I'm ready to go, baby. I'm ready to go. Ready for some Avada Kedavra, baby. <clears throat> Let me show you my... Alright. Okay. Press space bar to toggle. Sure. I'm a wizard, baby. I'm a wizard. Let's get it. Gravy, thanks for stopping by on the Hogwarts Express. We're about to kill some muggles. Hope you're ready. I think I'm going to dedicate the rest of my life to this game, to be honest. I mean, look, I even got, you know, fucking Hufflepuff stand up. Oh, shit, I can continue. My dumbass has just been sitting here looking at the screen. All right, let's do this. I never know how to actually do these. Like, yeah, that's kind of barely visible, but, like, that's barely visible, too. Screw it. We'll figure it out. going on oh here we go we are pleased to inform you that you've been accepted at hogwarts school of witchcraft and wizardry as a fifth year student love that i'm skipping a couple years term begins on the first of september preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle as you may be aware the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside of school however due to your unique circumstances the ministry has graciously allowed Agreed to allow Professor Elizer Fig to help you hone your spellcasting before escorting you from London to the castle for the start of term feast and the sorting ceremony. Yours sincerely, Professor Weasley, Deputy Headmistress. Yeah, all right, Anne. Let's go. Oh. Gotta look suave. Oh. Okay. Um. 
Already. So I don't know if I walk into this guy. Or to this dude. Yeah, I think I'm all in. Face shape. Yeah, let me get a little. What's my What's my head look like? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Skin color. Do I want glasses? Nah. Can I get a beard? Mm. Oh, that's a sick haircut. Gilberto. Nah, let's see, let's see, let's see. I see. I'm gonna think way too into this. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to that one. Hair color. Yo. Okay. Why are they f obsessed with scars? Jesus. Oh! Oh! Oh, 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 oh! Ah! Ah! Wait, is it on this side? Yeah! <laughs> I dig it! That's my complexion. Okay. Eyebrow color. Black. Give me them thick ass eyebrows. Thicker. Uh, maybe not that thick. Cool. Why can't I have a beard? Very well, be able to help you. Mm. That was quite something. I'm eager to get to help. A few cobwebs and some dust. I am. In that was quite something. Uh uh. It was wonderful. I I'm eager to get to hogs. A few cobwebs and some dust. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Oh hell yeah, that's a sexy ass voice, boy. You got put into Ravenclaw. Are you a Ravenclaw though? Like naturally? What are you? You're. You're Slytherin, aren't you? I connected my, uh, I made a wizardry account today because I knew I wanted to get sorted into Hufflepuff and I didn't want to, like, hear now. Okay, yeah, you're Slytherin. I mean, I guess Ravenclaws are assholes too, but don't tell Dorothy. Um, but yeah, I want to make sure I got put into Hufflepuff because, you know, gang gang. Um, so that should. Normal. Uh,. go you're a wizard cool <laughs> Woo, we're about to start let's go gang gang I'm gonna take a picture for the gram luckily you get to choose either way what I don't think they should let you choose I think they should let fate Run its course.
my familiar wants to join us. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the term begins. Why is my game running like ass? Eleazar, George, glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess <laughs> I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Of course. Why don't we speak on route to Hogwarts? We had a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Yeah. Wonderful idea. Once I get to actual gameplay, I'll lower it because. Tagging along? Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. It would be good to see the old pile of rocks. All right, dude says, hey, let's not talk about this here. There's people around. And then just straight up, like, fly in the air in a carriage. Like it's nothing. starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, He's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Fucking suit. Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a... We're already blaming goblins for shit? Unreal. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Love the mysterious disappearance of a wife. Received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly. To keep it safe. Looks like that thing from the Da Vinci Code. The apple. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that? I don't see a glow. Ugh! Oh, I'm extra magic, bitch. You already know. Gang, gang. How did you Wait. We do not know. Damn! Got his ass snatched! Uh -oh. 
Vagar is acting out. Great start. Great start. Are you right? You're hurt. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. He gone, man. What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never. Professor? Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. Can we just take a second to say, like, I got drip. I got a lot of drip right now. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Alright, finally I can change these settings. I'll just keep it at 60 for now. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right, and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. I mean, like, what else are you going to do here? for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic I don't know where she came into possession of the port key 
but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, oh, that's the path down below. This way. I kind of want to jump. Fuck it, let's go. We bolt. Oh, they won't let me. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone I still can't get over this drip. Like, look at my guy. Let's see some of that one work you were practicing. Pants are so high because of it, the, the flash center. flood warning. Oh. Yeah. Excellent. Stupefy! Thank you, sir. Can I fuck with that bird? I wanna fuck with that bird. Man, that old man got hops. We're close now, it's just ahead. No way, that's a real spell. Reparo? Fuck. <laughs> oh, that's sick. But who's? Who's home, Professor Figs? Who's? It says up. But up where? No, 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 no. No, you're not a wizard. Ah, uh, I see. Ah! Enchanted stone here. And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see it. It's some tea, you know, it is a British game after all. But 
Put the kettle on for it. Interact with the magic. Alright then. We're in Hogwarts! Wake the goblin? Why do I want to wake a goblin, dude? It just does not seem... Hello? Free money! After you! Now keep your hands inside the cart if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> Number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. I just want to know realistically, like, what that goblin is going to do. <clears throat> Professor, hmm? the old man that god was wearing is glowing. Like the glow you saw in the porky container. No, I'm darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. the last time this vault was accessed a goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years 
In that time, no one has visited Vault 12. Until today. Vault 12. Thank you for your help. we should be looking for. I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Best of luck. <sighs> Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Revelio! Revelio, perhaps. Revelio. Revelio. Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. and try again. No, you didn't see shit. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, to earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. But you're not going to teach me Lumos? Like, I feel like that'd be really good thing to know right now, Professor. Professor, please. Professor, I'm begging you. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again. I see something up ahead. What is it? Revelio. Spooky, spooky, spooky. some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you move, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection's turning towards me. 
does follow the light. Am I about to fight these dudes? Oh, let's go. We're a bunch of shooters out here. Lumos. Professor. Professor Fig. Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? Wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio.
are. How did you... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder... Are those the thoughts? Or memories? what you're seeing the glow that surrounded them yes sir astonishing <coughs> magic traces of an ancient magic to be precise the magic that miriam had always believed existed but could never miriam and perhaps george died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were all looked rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key. And <coughs> no! Let him go! Well, it's not exactly what I meant.
fights her. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. <laughs> no, you just act so casual. What are you chewing? Well, these load screens take forever. Sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, no, give me my drip back. I'll tell you this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the ministry. They need to know what happened to George as we warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Ceremonies over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has. God, this is like no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. <coughs> Pre 
Professor Weasley. Need one more to be sorted. No, oh, I'm just got red hair. You're just in time. Have a seat. Aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Mm. You do not give up easily, do you? You are undaunted by challenges that lie ahead. And your loyalty to a friend delayed your arrival here this evening. Perhaps you belong in Hufflepuff. <laughs> Hufflepuff, let's go! Let's go! Hufflepuff all day! One more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season you want to go outside? has been cancelled. What? Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But, don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of work, but I'm sure that's never stopped you before. It hasn't, Professor. <laughs> <coughs> Here we are at the entrance to the Hufflepuff Common Room. This is the entrance. Indeed. I will explain what to do, but I hesitate to do it myself as one errant knock leads to being doused in vinegar. Most unpleasant. You must tap the barrel, two from the bottom, middle of the second row, in the rhythm of Hell Garth Hufflepuff. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Looks 
like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Oh, this place is such a vibe. It's like cozy little badgers. Hello. She's awfully regal, isn't she? Is that your owl? I don't know who she is. Likely one of the Hufflepuffs around here. Owls choose their own company anyway. Wait, you're the new fifth year. Quite the dramatic entrance you made. Can't imagine wanting to call attention to yourself. Especially since everyone will be watching to see how much you already know. All right, Lenora. I am a bit concerned. I have a lot of catching up to do. Indeed. Four years of schoolwork is a bit. Of course, presumably, as a hard working Hufflepuff, I'm hard working too, as you might suspect. Sometimes I think I should have been a Ravenclaw. Don't ever say that shit to me again. <laughs> I'll fucking Avada Kedavra your ass so quick. I'm Lenora, by the way. Lenora Everly. Well, mustn't keep you. You have such a lot to do. you really think you should have been in Ravenclaw? Well, my brothers were. They both work in the Ministry now. My aunt was a Gryffindor, though, and I've always had plenty in common with her. Determined. The old sorting hat was spoiled for choice with me. It was nice meeting you, Lenora. Of course. Adieu. Didn't like her. Let's see if you're any better. Mysterious, You're like already. Puff, yes, I'm Adelaide. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you, Adelaide. Is all right? Oh yes, I'm just a bit distracted. Letter from my uncle. So tell me, I've been hearing all sorts of rumors. Were you really nearly gobbled up by a dragon? Baby girl, you wouldn't even know. You can't comprehend. That one is true. Not the typical start for a new school. That's dreadful. Well, I'm glad you made it here alive. Well, anyway, I imagine you have lots to do. I hope you have a wonderful first day. Hmm. It's a wonderful first day now that I met you, Adelaide. Oh! Oh! Are you sure everything's all right with your uncle? Oh, yes. He travels for work, always busy. I'm sure he just wrote... Thank you, Adelaide. Be seeing you. Of course. And good luck. Thank you, Adelaide. I love you. Hello, Arthur. Nice to meet you. Was that your cat? No, one of the first years, I think. Don't have any pets of my own, unfortunately. I'm sorry to hear that. I think magical beasts are rather incredible. Best thing about coming to Hogwarts. Nifflers, Glumbumbles, Bowtruckles. I thought they were only pictures in books. Well, Dad did bring home a puff skiing once. Mum was your... Anyway, I'd better go make sure the first years caught that cat. Don't want them to be late. Have you ever had a pet? No. My mum. Nice meeting you, Arthur. And good luck. Thank you. 
Try not to get lost in the castle yourself. God, I want to get lost in this castle so it's bad. The new Hufflepuff out of bed yet? Professor Weasley's waiting for them outside the common room. Just say it to me. I can hear you. We're in the same room. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. Let's go, baby. I've been baby. dreaming of this day for a long time. I can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, You'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. This way. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. What up, Charging? Um. No, I'm not. I'll be honest. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Do keep up. I hope he brings another balloon as a surprise guest. Simply cast Revelio on it, and we'll see what the guide says. Revelio. Oh. Yo, Gotti, shut up. to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall.
Revelio! Oh, these loadings are killing me, dog. Charging, what should I have for dinner? What do you think I should do? And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all. For good, sure. <laughs> yeah, all right. Let me just get that grub hunt. Defense against the dark arts classes today, and I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. What will I learn in Charles' class? I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. Can you tell me more? Defense against the dark arts, as the name implies. A mastery of defense against the dark arts. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever gifted Professor Hecate in charge of us. mentioned Hog Hogsmeade is the only all wizarding village in Britain and is home. You should be able to find all of the schools. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there. Thank you, Professor Wheat. A lot to absorb on your first. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments. Dude, uh, those places are not in South yeah. Dallas. <laughs> Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier. You did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your... My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a certain... I'm sorry, Professor. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil? Professor Fig. Oh? Yes. Ah. Hmm. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you too. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that... Very well. Enough chit-chat. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to ex... Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field gun. And invaluable to <clears throat> me. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. I did my best. I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the detail. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster. Understood, Professor. 
Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled... Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another, why don't I show you the clever inch? Unfold it and have a... Oh, dude, Wobby House would sound so good right now. Oh, shit, Wobby House is so nice. But you got a lot of good spots around you. to help you. This will be incredibly helpful. Now, it sounds like you've quite a day ahead. What with class, you'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to... Rebellion. Oh shit, man! I'm sorry. I hope you hope you have a speedy recovery. How how long do you uh get to like eat soups and stuff, or are you good? every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. <laughs> Shut your ass up is what she said. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? <laughs> One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity. Especially in the heat of battle. Now. Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small.
Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Let us begin with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, Levioso is good. Now, the basic cast. Well done. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, I want a fair duel, using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Levioso. This should be easy. Protego. Still more Hago. Complicates things. This cannot be your first. Levioso. Let's just say I'm all my students with this again. I do enjoy my students. Try to anticipate your opponent's next move. Bunch of shooters out here, bitch. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Point to Hufflepuff. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. Uh -huh. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblin. Understood, Professor. Again, well done today. I... All right. Enough. I'd hate to face mm -hmm. Professor Hecate in a duel. How about you uh, face me in the common room? <laughs> oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. Hell yeah, Arthur. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. You dueled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. My girl Adelaide, I love you. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling and I didn't expect a new... Then again. I've dueled enough. <laughs> Fair enough. You, are... you know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Excellent. Knew I was right. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break yeah, the rules. Yeah, Fuck the rules. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, you just have to be clever. Thank you, Sebastian. Good. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. Until next time. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you. Rebellion. Not the other way around. Indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Don't you 
see the romance of it all? You and I, we are the stuff of poems. Our love is the beauty of a thousand lives. Rebellion. You want to? All right. I gotta take a break. I think the pups are hungry and want to go outside. Thank you for coming by. Love you guys.